Hello again. My name is Matthew Upton from Ross and back at you this week on June, Monday, June 3rd, for another update of the Northeast conditions, mainly looking at Massachusetts to Virginia and North Carolina area. And we're looking at the overall sea surface temperature and ocean color data. And I know a lot of you guys are getting itchy for conditions to improve and they are warming up and they are improving. Um, unfortunately, it's been a little bit of a slow start to the season, but things are gonna be ramping up pretty quick, we hope. And let's take a look at the sea surface temperature. This is mainly from the weekend imagery, Saturday and Sunday, and partly from today, mo Monday, June 3rd. We had some clouds blow through on Sunday and Monday, but it seems to be pretty clear with a, with a two or three day composite here. So let's look at what's going on. We still have um, so a lot of cool inshore water. I mean, we're talking in the 60s, 58 to 60, 61 degrees. However, the inshore water is warming quite rapidly. Now we're up to 64, 65 degrees, 70, degrees 68 to 70 degrees down off of Virginia so this that's the start of tuna migrating inshore and mahi and the start of the season so what we have here for main features to keep an eye on this large Gulf Stream warm core clockwise rotating eddy this water is cool around it but it also has some 65 66 degree water here just offshore a thousand fathoms this will continue to move to the west and then southwest for into the canyon areas, hopefully. But what you've noticed is this Gulf Stream is rather warm for this time of year. It's already up to 81, 82 degrees, which is warmer than normal. Um, something to be not, not concerned about, but take keep an eye on. We've got the Gulf Stream pushing up again to the north, not too far off of Toms and Hudson Canyon, just about um, you know, another 20, 30 miles from, or 40 miles from Hudson to Toms, you're in the Gulf Stream water. There's a nice Gulf Stream eddy here, another one here. These are counterclockwise eddies, and another one here. And what this have done over the last couple of weeks, it's pushed in some warmer, you know, blue-green, clearer water into the canyon areas. It started pushing in a couple weeks ago, Memorial Day weekend time frame off of Wilmington, Baltimore, and now it's migrating down to Washington and Norfolk Canyon. So you have some decent water that they've caught some yellowfin on. Um, poor man's earlier last week, late week, Baltimore Canyon, now Washington and Norfolk Canyon. There's some yellowfin tuna in this water. There's a uh, little clockwise eddy rotating this way, another clockwise rotating eddy off of Norfolk Canyon. This is pushing in and, and pulling down some decent Gulf Stream filaments that has produced a few tuna. And up off the point, the tuna, the tuna, um, uh, some of the charter guys have been catching yellowfin tuna at a better rate lately. There's another clockwise eddy rotation off of uh, Oregon Inlet. That's bringing some decent water up over the foul, good bottom structure area. You know, the, the, out, out east, there's not a whole lot to be super excited about, but it's gonna warm pretty quickly. And once this eddy, there's another eddy here, another clockwise rotating eddy here. Once this interacts with the Gulf Stream, it's gonna push up, pull up some water into the canyon areas. So this is, the proximity of this Gulf Stream is, is very encouraging for you guys fish in the canyons here pretty soon. Um, a lot of this water in here is still in the six, low 60s, but there'll still soon, soon be some swordfish. There probably already is swordfish, big eye tuna, and some of that water. For the east, we're taking, any, taking a look at what's going on out here. Um, not a whole lot, but these waters are, you know, warm water, 65, almost 68 degrees over, over some of the canyons. And switching over to the ocean color image, same time frame uh, over the weekend. Nice composite here. You can see where these eddies 
are pretty pronounced and some of this water's pulling in over the it's still pretty cool but some clean water with some favorable conditions especially over the point here this nice strong edge even though this is a warm core Gulfstream eddy it's got greener water around it but some nice clear water in, in between this water is pushing up here this water is pushing pulling around this way so there's some promising conditions out here and i think things are going to warm up pretty quickly so to stay tuned to ross um, give us a call to order analysis for your specific area to get a better idea what's going on because the tuna are around it's a matter of time this water is warming quite rapidly especially the gulf stream areas so it won't be long now before the bigger populations are moving in thank you and we will be in touch